When Andrew W.K. released his first album in 2001, something unexpected happened. A common reaction that really, really surprised me and that I was very, very interested in was this idea that I was a fraud or that I was hired to make this music or to f be a front man for the music made by someone else, that I was an actor, basically that I was not real. To be someone who does certainly exist, maybe not in the way that someone thinks, or maybe not in the, even the way I think, but to exist somehow, and then to have someone tell you that you don't, it made me very angry, it made me very frustrated. But the more he thought about it, the more Andrew came to like the rumors. I thought about what it means to be oneself, and what does it mean to be me. Maybe they were right, and maybe I was wrong, maybe I really am not real. And maybe they're picking up on something that I was even blind to, because we all can appear to many people as many different things at different times, just like you can meet someone and say, wow, I really like this guy. And then two days later, your friend says, hey, did you ever meet so-and-so? Gosh, he's such a jerk. So I took the feelings of anger that people were saying I was a fake and turned it around into excitement that people were saying I was a fake. I guess I got excited about the idea of my own subjectivity and how other people could reduce me to nothing. Type Andrew WK into our search box to see more of our interview with Andrew, or at least the guy we think is Andrew.